Hey family, today we're going to talk about animals. Many of you probably have pets like dogs or cats. And if you've ever gone to the zoo, you've probably seen really cool animals like tigers, penguins, and elephants. But today, we're going to look at 10 extreme animals you've never seen before. Word. Our first animal is the Dumbo octopus, which is named after a character you may know. Like Dumbo the elephant, the Dumbo octopus has big ears, which help it move through the water. This is different from other octopi, which rely on jet propulsion to get from place to place. Our next animal is the Maine wolf, and it lives in South America. The Maine wolf is almost three feet tall at the shoulder, making it the tallest wild canine in the world. When threatened, the wolf's mane hairs will stand on end to make it seem even bigger. Hey, you looking at me? Our next animal has some extreme height, though this time it's really short. This is the leaf deer, and it's only about 20 inches tall. Found in Asia, the leaf deer inhabits dense forests and wooded mountains. And because they're so small, researchers are still figuring out how many places they live. And speaking of weird places to live, let's take a look at the purple frog. These lumpy frogs actually spend most of their time underground. And you would too if you look like that. Found in India, the purple frog diet consists mainly of termites and insects. This next creature looks like a plant, but it's actually an animal. This is a sea pen, and it's named after old quill pens. The sea pen lives in the ocean and survives on a diet of plankton. It can range in color from orange to white, and it actually lights up when you touch it. Here's another water creature, and man is in a weird one. A cousin of the piranha, the paku fish has teeth as well, but these look like human teeth. Brother, you need to floss. Don't worry though, although it can still deliver a nasty bite, the paku fish is a plant eater and dines only on fruits and seeds. Woo! Back on land, this is the stoat, a small little animal that does it all. The stoat is active day and night and can live in forests, fields, and along the coast. It eats everything from lizards to fish to rabbits and can travel up to 20 miles per hour to catch its prey. It also has the ability to change its color in response to the seasons. Man, check out that coat! Now what's this? Ah! It's the Goliath beetle, one of the largest insects in the world. The Goliath beetle is found mostly on the continent of Africa. And believe it or not, people actually keep them as pets. Would you want to own one of these? Not me. If you've ever seen a giraffe, you know how long the necks on some animals can be. Well, here's one you might not expect, the Eastern long neck turtle. Common in Eastern Australia, the long neck turtle has a neck that is almost as long as its entire shell. Instead of retracting its neck when threatened, the long neck turtle bends its neck sideways to fit under its shell. It also has the ability to emit a stinky odor to ward off predators. Okay, who farted? Now, we've come to our last animal, and I'm sure you've never seen this one before. This is called the Glyptodon, which is covered in thick armor like its relative, the armadillo. Glyptodonts were super big and can grow up to 10 feet long. Unfortunately, they all went extinct a long time ago, so you only see these in museums. We don't want to lose any more of these crazy animals, so don't forget to do your part to keep them around. See you next time. Peace.